17-year-old high school student Dacia Taylor invented color-changing sutures by dyeing them with beetroot juice. This was initially just a science fair project, but ended up attracting a lot of attention and even being submitted for a patent. Remember the pH scale from science class? Well, when stitches get infected, their surface pH shifts from acidic to basic because bacteria like to live in basic environments. This causes the beetroot dye on the stitches to go from red to purple, indicating that bacteria are multiplying underneath. In many developing countries, up to 30 percent of surgical procedures result in surgical site infections. So if an effective way of sterilizing and mass producing these sutures is developed, they can be a cost-effective way of ensuring surgical site infections are discovered and treated early. However, in the case of surgery involving deeper tissues, the infection only reaches the skin at later stages. So in these cases, if there's a high risk for developing infections, smart sutures would be a better option, although these would be much more expensive and require smart devices to access the information. So the low-tech option may be more realistic. Realistic.